So Hasey rewrite saying, which U.S. politicians from the last 30 years, i.e. post-Cold War, do you most admire and agree with and why? Don't say no one. It's a cop-out answer. Armin, U.S. politicians. Okay, so as even though I am a diehard capitalist, I would have to say Bernie Sanders, even though I completely disagree with his economic policies, not completely, with many of his economic policies, when it comes to foreign policy, I think um, his consideration for, you know, human lives and reducing misery around the world is high enough. For me, that's more important than his his correct takes on those is more important to me than his bad economic policies. Mm -hmm. So Bernie Sanders. Yeah. Wow. That's a see again, a, sort of an unexpected answer. Um, I, I, I would say probably like what, okay. So who do I agree with the most? I mean, generally Barack Obama, I kind of agreed with a lot. Um, even sort of before Barack Obama came in, like there's a lot of positions that he had. He had a very kind of good balance between, um, you know, when it came to foreign policy, it was like, you know, this Iraq war is dumb, but you know, we need to do certain things in Afghanistan and Pakistan, got rid of terms like the war on terror, made it more of a geographical thing. Than others. And some of those things worked, some of them didn't, but I, uh, I did agree with him a lot. And the second guy, actually, I agree with a lot who I don't think practically works out. And I, I feel like he gets a coward a lot by his advisors is Andrew Yang. Um, oh yeah. Yeah. I really, I like you. Yeah, I, I whenever he talks about anything, most of the things he talks about, like I'm completely on board with. Like I, I, I love it's and it's not just a UBI, it's his positions on, on many things. But mm -hmm. I feel like, and I know this for a fact because I, one of my really good friends was, you know, he he consulted for Andrew Yang for a little bit. Um uh, but he has I, I just think he's got really bad advisors and he listens to them. I don't think he's confident enough in his own way of thinking about things that he's not familiar with. Just I, I hope Andrew, yeah. Well, I mean, I, I don't think he's listening, but he's. I, I, I hope he actually does sort of think about things and and comes up with the kind of novel positions on these issues that he's not as familiar with, um, and thinks about them himself mm. rather than just taking advice from people blindly. Oh yeah, and Mars is reminding us that he's starting a third political party. I don't know how that will go. Hey guys, if you want to join these streams live, get your comments and questions read by Ali. Armin and the guests, and most importantly, to get full access to the full video versions of all these episodes, become a patron. Link in the description below.